right, welcome back to part 2 of my market price series. Before we start I want to once again explain the reason for this series. I do this only to show you guys what the prices has been at, where they have went and what I think they will be in the future. I also tell you what I buy them at and how much I've sold them for. If I rarely sell anything, I would not say I sold them frequently, but I would probably say I sold a few of these. I want to say that these videos are not to brag, they are also not to trick anyone. This is just to give you a good foundation in what the market has looked like in the past and what I do with my ISK. If you want to do as I do that's fine, but the main reason is to give you the tools you need to think for yourself and have a good start in the market values. So to those who might think I do this for other reasons than help out, you obviously have never worked hard for a YouTube channel, my subscribers are everything, and to do something that would compromise that is just not happening. Also a few people think selling items for 500% or 1000% above the price is impossible, saying that people would never buy it. This is very hard for me to prove since I essentially have to print screen exactly when I sell something or even record it. And most of the stuff that I sell I do when I'm offline, pretty much when I'm sleeping. But here is some screenshot that yes, they can be faked, that I'm pretty sure some people will say, but they ain't. So they will pop up now. And I sold this between the last video and now. And this is also, I bought them in Jita and I sold them in Jita. There's a different way if you want to sell them in Amar. This is not what the series is about. So with that out of the way, let's continue. And this time I think that we will start looking at the guns. So for example, the high slots. And uh, let's just start. So go to lasers. Now the Senti C type small lasers have been quite high for a long time it's been at 4 million and it was at 17 or and 20 million in the beginning and they have been steady at 9 8 9 7 million now for a long time and i think this is a good price for them so this has actually a great price right now i would not buy it for uh, flip it in the future this can uh, probably go down a bit in the future so it's a good price if you have them it's a, it's a good price to maybe sell or maybe just use them. We also got the core PC and it's pretty much the same thing, so. We go to medium now, now, oh, damn. Well, someone bought them up, so. <laughs> uh, hold on. All right. All right, all right, let me get back in on track. So the Centum C-Type Medium Pulse Lasers, uh, we got these bows, we got the Corpum too. Um, they, uh, they are at a pretty good price right now. They used to be about 1 million and I would buy them. Uh, I would sell them at maybe 3.5 3 million and now they're up in 4.5. They will probably be at around 10 million in the future too. So it's going steady up. Now people have bought them so they have been forced up right now. But it doesn't matter. Now if you have them, if you bought them for below a million or something, you can actually sell them for four. So that was good. Uh, I would not buy them now. I would wait for them to be like a million or maybe one and a half if you want to buy some of them. But yeah, anyway, so we go on. We go on to the large ones. The large ones, uh, the pulse ones, is, is not as frequently used. So they are very cheap today. I think this will be about 15 million in the future. Uh, so they are actually quite cheap compared to the beams. They are a bit more expensive because we use them more when we're doing encounters and storylines and so on. But let's go to the beams here. We go to the small beams. Also having a great price. More people are inclined to fly frigates. And, uh, and that's why these guns are used more frequently. And that's why they are more expensive. And this is what I would like to see on the market for every item. So the times when we go and hunt them, we will actually find some decent gear that we can sell and make a profit off. They have hold the same price before as today. I think that looks good. Now the medium beam lasers on the other hand is not as frequently used. They are extremely cheap. I buy them now and then. Everything that is below a million, I can just buy up everything. If you don't have any and if you want to buy them and turn them over, 
this is a great buy in my opinion they were expensive before and i hope that they will be up at at least five six million in the future then we got the large beam ones these are used frequently because we use them as i said in in encounters this is a good price i mean they will probably be like 15 plus in the price in the future they have been at 27 like 30 million in the beginning but yeah that is it the rail guns they are also very nice uh, the prices have been steady at between like 5 and 8 million for a long time i do see them go up to 10 15 million in the future right now they uh they're pretty average i would buy them if they were below like four maybe three and a half million i would say that's a good price we got the medium ones the same here we don't use them as frequently this is a great buy if you want to buy for the future personally i buy them at yeah below a million i think they will probably be five to seven million in the future i can't remember what they were in the beginning though but i think i think they were like 10 in the beginning i don't know really i'm not sure then we get the large ones they are used more frequently and i think the prices are a bit high right now so if you have them and you don't need them then it, this is a good time to sell them i don't think they will be more expensive in the future either so i personally don't even own them which is bad we get the Krelly snub nose now these are used very much as well the prices are good, 8, 8, 9, 10 million. That's pretty much what I think they should be at in the future too. I can't remember when they were below 5. So they have been pretty steady, I would say. It's not, it's nothing I would buy to invest or something like that. Now we got the medium ones, the same here. They're pretty cheap. Now they are at a million. Um, but you can see here if you just buy a few you can probably crank out a few at 13 million here if you fly galente then you know buy some extra why not and i can't actually remember the price i think it was like 11 million in the beginning but i don't know now we got the cool c type large snub nose now we use them very much uh, and and you can see at the prices i think it's speed high i don't think that they will be this high in the future I think they will be like 30 million maybe so don't buy them to hold them um, but of course buy them if you need them now we're going to the cannons the cannons is also something that people use all the time the prices are good i think they're a little bit low but it's still it's still pretty good i think they will be like 8 10 million in the future well they have been more expensive but um just for a short while and I don't actually think that they will be cheaper. The Gistem C-Type Medium Auto Cannons, they're actually pretty cheap. It's still, I mean, it's still above a million. I'm not sure if I would buy them to sell them. Um, but if, if you fly these ships, then it's a good price to buy them. They have been a lot more expensive in the beginning. About, I think it was like 14 million. Uh, but they have gone down. But I still think it's a good price to buy them now. Uh, but as I said, it's it's not that good if you want to buy them and hoard them. If you just want to buy them for profit in the future, I don't think it's so good. And then we got the large one, the large auto cannon. They're pretty cheap. I would say um, if you're going to fly these battleships in the future, then, you know, buy a few. We don't know if they boost it or not. If they, if they do some update and we use this even more, then this is going to be a great price if you have bought them already. Now go to the... <laughs> strike cannons <laughs> uh the small ones are good i think they are at the right price uh they have been cheaper actually uh they are, have also been more expensive i will put prices up of course as always i don't think it's an investment here i think it's the prices it should be the medium ones is a bit worse now this is actually something that you should be buying in my opinion i buy them they need to go up in price they will probably be like the small ones around five seven maybe even ten million in the future so if you buy them now i think it's good now the c type large strike cannons is pretty much the same i mean we don't use them as much a bit heavier in the prices though uh, i'm not sure if i would buy them because it is a matter of if they're getting a buff or not so we we don't know that but i mean it's a good price if you want to fly a ship and have them then I would buy them they are not too expensive 
Uh, decomposer. <laughs> um, I actually don't know much about them. <laughs> and since we don't even have the blue one, so I can actually skip it. Ooh, that's... thank you. Uh, we got the PTC small missile launcher. Now, this one has been manipulated so many times. The prices are extremely high. I mean, it's the only way to get them, so you have to buy them. I bought mine at around 5 million each, and I uh, do sell them today. I was not the guy who, who pressed these prices. I was just unfortunate to have bought some before. Uh, but yeah, this uh, this is just because the meta is the way it is. This is why it's so expensive. I think they're the most expensive now as they've ever been. If you don't want to put that money out, you can buy the Disciple one, which also go up, of course. You also have the, uh, I think the Domination, right? Yeah, it also went up. But in my in my humble opinion, I would buy the Republic because they are a lot cheaper. And the damage is not that different. And then we got the torpedoes, the small ones. Uh, the prices are actually pretty high. They were very cheap before. So if you have them, it's a good time to sell. Other than that, I think it's at, at the price it should be. It might go up, it might go down. But I think this is a price for the future too. So Then we got the PvP launchers. <laughs> uh, I think the prices are good. They're a bit high, a little bit on the top. But this is what I think is good for the prices. Like I say, around 10 million for small guns is a good price. It's good for the game. Uh, so this is a little bit on top, but yeah. We then got the medium missile launchers, which is also a bit on top. People using them. This is great. I want to see these prices because if we have these prices, then that means that the game is thriving. Uh, there is not too much of the items out and uh, we actually use them up so this is good i think it's nice it's not a good price if you want to buy them for profit but it's a good price as a unit so we got the medium torpedo launchers a bit under the low end they will probably be around 10 million or you know 8 million maybe in the future i would not buy them for the future because we don't really know and then we have the pitsy large rapid missile launchers I think they actually are in a pretty good place. I would say 30 million is great. If they are at 30 million or maybe 20 million in the future, I would be happy. Because as I say, if large is at 30 million, then the B type will be about 100, 120 maybe. And that means that the A type will be about five, 600 million. And the, and the X type will then be close to like 2 billion. And I think that is a nice, step in the price i mean i would like to see that so that is good the large missile launchers or emissions and encounters i would say this is the price maybe up to 20 million at tops not much more i can say about that we have the pitim c large torpedo launchers i i have a problem with this one because i have i just don't see them being used as frequently uh but the prices should definitely go up to 10 or yeah maybe 15 million maybe even more actually but i would not buy them for the future i think it's pretty good it's not as bad now the harvest equipment i cannot actually oh we don't have any blue never mind then we actually have the remote shield boosters on this one as well yeah we got two types of the small remote shield boosters the prices are a bit on the high end 10 million i think it's a uh, i would think 5 million in the future but obviously we use them a lot, so um, I don't know. This is a high price. Um, yeah, it's a high price. Then we got the medium ones, and they are quite cheap. Now they're, they used to be even cheaper. I buy everything below a million from both of these. Uh, I do sell them for 14 million. I can sell them for 9 million. It's it different, but I mean it's a lot of profit from one item, so... We got the large ones. I think they have good price too. I don't buy them. I don't sell them. We got the remote armor repairers. This is the same thing. The small ones are a bit more expensive. I think it's a bit high. So I would not buy them for profit. I do not actually sell them. I did sell them in the beginning. I think I sold them at like 7, 6 million. So I actually could have sold them now and make more money of it. But I didn't. Now the Corpum C remote I keep buying. Everything below a million I buy. 
I do sell them as well at 14 million or 7 million. I mean, if I can buy them for 300, 600, 1 million and I sell them for 7 million, that's a 7x win. I think that's good. Here you can see 18 for 250. That's a great buy. I could actually buy it right now. Should I buy it or should I let you guys buy it? I'm letting you guys buy it. We got the large ones. Um, I have not bought any one of these. I have not sold anyone and I don't own anyone so I cannot actually say anything about this. I think the prices are a bit low. I think they would be about 10 million but it's it's hard. It's actually hard. It's just like I want to say they want to be 10 million. Yeah that was it. That was the guns. And as I said if you like this series if you want me to continue then tell me that in the comments. I can maybe do the mid slot or I can do rigs. Someone said rigs. I can go through more stuff if you guys want and I hope this helped you and I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.